Hello, it's Lisa with Fossil Fan and Female. Today is December the 18th, 2022. It's cold in New Mexico. Co, 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 burr, 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 burr. But it looks like it is everywhere. So thanks for joining me. I hope you guys have had a good, what is today, Sunday. I am just coming to show you what I believe are fossils I've found. Hopefully you can see I'm okay. I find these to be very, very, very interesting. Do do do. Interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> I'm trying to be too shaky. These were all. No, this one was found. This is very odd here. It feels like plastic. It doesn't look like plastic. So I don't know. Would you know? Might you know? If you do, leave a comment. Very interesting. Wouldn't you say so? I say so. <laughs> Um, anyway, that's just a very curious item to find. I think I found that in Truth or Consequences, uh, New Mexico. This is, um, I can't forget the name of it. I can look it up. What is it? It's that, um, dang it. A Chalcedon, Chalcedony? I think it's Chalcedony. But I'm not absolutely sure. Let's see, is that too is that not bright enough? That's too much. I don't know. You guys tell me, is it good? Is it bad? This right here, look, that looks like the how the inside of like a your body would be. This is mineralized, something different inside. And then there's another layer of something different. So that looks like inside a bone possibly would be from mineralization, um, fossilization, you know, like I'm thinking these things right here came from after the Noah's flood, the stuff that got buried instantly with lots of mud and then it was there for so many years. Now it's coming back up. The time is drawing near. Mysteries are getting answered. Here is something I do want to slice open. So I will. I'm very, very curious about this one. But I will do it and make a video. Because this ball right here is nice and heavy. It's heavy so that I don't know if it's a geo, but still you want to see what's in, in it. You know, it's kind of like, I want to see what's all in that little ball. All in that little ball. This one's beautiful. Can't really see all the wonderful colors. But again, it looks like it could have been a smashed head. That mineralized. Side view, of course. Who knows what was even here living at, you know, long, long time ago. But I was thinking about taking them up to the college, like a few of them, and asking them to, if they can do anything to find out, like, you know, if they're actually fossils and bones and etc. Because I'm very curious about it. That's oh. just too cute. Too cute. And it's got a flat bottom, so it sits just like that. <laughs> it's crazy. Hi. <laughs> I just as I'm amazed at what you can find out there. Again, this is another one that I think is a skull of something. I have many of these and they look similar. I know water causes them to have holes, but this is bone and it looks like it is a, you know, head that has been in water or mud for many, many years and then it mineralized like that.
But not until I find out will I know. Unless you guys think you know. Please leave a comment if you think you do. If you think you know what it is. That would be great. Love learning. Love learning. Here's another one I think is like a skull. That's a side view. The front view. The top view. Front. Side. Back. And bottom. What do you think? It's pretty heavy. I think it's a skull, but I don't know of what. Here's another one I think is a skull. That's the side. Front. Other side. Back. Top. And bottom. don't know and this looks like it's I don't know a ball of something it's very scratchy like sandpaper and it has all this weird you know yellowish stuff orangish stuff all around in the crevices of it not sure it's just a ball of something scratchy and let's see. <sighs> Back. Side. Front. I think top. And bottom. What do you think of that? Pretty cool. Let's see. This one. This one's... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah! 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 <laughs> it's funny. Um, anyway, these, this one is very interesting, too. I think it's also a bone. It could be a skull of something. I don't know what. But to me, I think it's a skull of something small that used to live some time ago. What do you think? That's the way I have it set up because it sits flat like that. Kind of cool, huh? Ah! We have this one here. Very interesting. And this one's interesting, too. Oops, almost dropped it. Interesting. Here is very soft, very smooth, very colorful as far as, you know, reds. It looks like the insides of something that used to be alive.
Yeah, we have this nice, uh, interesting specimen. Something inside there. Do you think I should cut it out? Cut it in half? Very intriguing. I kind of want to know what's inside there. Is there anything inside there? <laughs> it is so interesting. Even this little guy here is interesting. Look at that. Very interesting, don't you think? Man, I just find those interesting. Um, we got that one. This one is another very interesting. There's a little, like, a kind of a heart there. All those little things, like a conglomerate. But it, don't know, it could have been something that was alive back long ago. Strange looking, though. smooth here so this looks like another one I need to cut open and see what it is anyway we're almost on 15 minutes I was gonna stick to 15 minutes it's long enough it takes forever to upload if you go over like 15 minutes crazy this one is another curious one I think it's kind of shaped as a skull like the many others I have found shaped like a skull that could have been smashed Maybe a serpent. I don't know. What do you think? Mm, it's very heavy. Those are heavy. Here's another one that's interesting looking. Like part of a skull, maybe. It's the same type of bone. if you can see the porousness of it or not but it's bone and we got another one of these it's bone this one's interesting too and there's the inside you know the part that's broken off so right here could have been the mineralization of what used to flow through this bone. And I showed you that one, I think. I showed you this one, didn't I? First one. I don't know. Anyway, this one's very, very curious about this one. It's, again, it's a bone. To me, it looks like it was a skull of something, but, um, shoot, I don't know. And we have this one, too. That would be a pretty big serpent, huh? Sometimes even like that right there looks like the bottom of serpents, you know, and their their colorization on the top uh, also like looks like some, you know, what they look like regularly, normally, whatever, when they're alive. This one is another one that looks kind of smashed of some sort. So maybe it was a water type. It's very smooth water animal. Didn't know. Just went over 15. So let's see if I want to do another right before I say goodbye. Um, ow. Sorry. Oh, and I have this little thing here. This is cool. Look at that one. Another ball that I think I should cut open.
cut it open, right? Cut it open, cut it open. I think so. And this. These are all so cool. I just want to show you, but my time, my time is going fast. That I'm not sure. It kind of looks like wood. But then again, it kind of looks like bone. It's amazing how the living things have a lot of similarities. Same like this one right here. Look at this. I don't know. What do you guys think? Even though it's not as good to touch and all, I was just curious about what you think. Anyway, thanks for joining me. See you next time. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Ciao!